All right, world premiere. This is exciting. This is like the day. Like this thing is real. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to the world pre It's probably not that serious. The box is in front of us. Hold something very important. <laughs> For about the last month or so, you guys have been seeing me ride in this jacket. There have been numerous comments on my first drive videos. Chase, what jacket is that? Where did you get it from? And why do you look so fashionable? Well, today is the day we can finally talk about it. Ladies and gentlemen, Engine Hawk is official. Uh, it's officially in flight. Uh, yep, sorry about that uh, community. So. If you guys don't know, Rurok, yes, the company that makes really cool helmets. Here, let me show you one. Yes, the company that makes this thing, the Atlas 2.0. This is my first ride helmet. Ooh, it's so fancy. Wow, how cool. Apparently, dominating the helmet market was not enough for Rurok. They were like, you know what we need to disrupt again? the jacket market. So what Rurok did was start a jacket company called Engine Hawk with what might be the most coolest logo for a company I have ever seen. It's like an MV Agusta exhaust, but it also looks like a hawk. It's crazy. Okay, enough of the bull crap. In today's episode, world exclusive, we are unboxing the final things. These things, Bo's got a jacket, I've got this one. These are prototypes. These are not their final thing. I don't know what this unboxing experience is. All I know is there is a Engine Hawk logo on the box and there is Engine Hawk tape on this box. So ladies and gentlemen, let me use my messed up Leatherman, RIP, uh, F in the chat for my Leatherman that got messed up on a fire truck shoot. Okay, blades out, oh God. Just cut myself. It's okay, worth it. Let's get in to the official unboxing experience of the Engine Hawk jacket. Now, if you're asking yourself, Chase, are you gonna review it? Yes, of course I am. It's gonna be after a while though, because you guys know I like to ride in things and learn how they are and how they feel before I tell you guys if you should go buy them or not. So, let's unbox this thing. How does... Just so you guys know, uh, we here at the shop have not uh, seen the final thing. I haven't. I don't even know how the unboxing experience is on this stuff, so I'm gonna have to figure this out with you guys. Am I on the right side? Whoa. Okay. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> Do you see this? Hold on. Hold on. It's not ready. Are you guys seeing this right now? Engine the Hawk just... Bro! <laughs> Engine Hawk was born to revolutionize the motorcycle industry and completely redefine what motorcycle apparel can be. Welcome to Engine Hawk. Engine Hawk boxing, Engine Hawk taping, Engine Hawk... Bro, we got Engine Hawk like, uh, like meat paper. This is amazing. Okay, got a cool Engine Hawk little... I ripped it! Meat paper. I don't know. It's called parchment paper. Oh, okay. Meat paper. <laughs> oh, I didn't want to cut the Engine Hawk sticker. Okay. Da, 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 da. Oh my goodness. Oh, that's a bag. Bro. That's just a bag. Oh, that's so cool. I don't know why I'm getting so excited about a bag, but I'm like hype. Engine Hawk bag. Hold on. The boys are gonna be happy today. Nothing but Engine Hawk stickers. Yay! That's awesome. Okay. So that's the unboxing experience, dude. That's the uh 
Hold on one second. Let me get. All right. So this is the same one as I have on, except this. Ooh. There's no way they changed the leather before, between the, come over here, pop. B cam's not gonna move real quick. Feel, uh, but don't touch this yet. <laughs> feel mine. Okay. You've ridden it a little bit. I've been yet. riding this for a month and a half. Now feel this. How does this feel like it's been ridden in? There's no way they changed the leather that fast. No, well, it may not be the leather, but it might be. You see what I'm saying though? This feels worn in. Like I've been riding, I've put like hundreds of miles in on this guy and it's comfortable. This feels like a same thickness. It just might be a, or like I put a coating on it or something. Like, yeah. Like it fe you know what it feels like? It feels conditioned. So when I do with all my boots, I put like- The stuff you were telling me to the do saddle this thing? Yeah, that's what it feels okay, like. Okay, let's uh, let's investigate uh, my pre-production versus this one real quick. You can a hundred. Hold on, I'm gonna put my old one on in front. So guys, I've been riding with this Engine Hawk jacket. Actually, it's probably been like two months now. So I've put a lot of time into this one. But the guys over at Engine Hawk were like, "Hey, this is pre-production. Let us know what you think about it." I've loved the jacket honestly since I've had it. Oh, and they even changed this little tagging. Whoa, what is that? Hold on. I'm, this is like a kid in a candy store, dude. So mine has this like little chain here. Bro, they got a motorcycle chain. Do you see that? How cool is that? Comes with a back protector, comes with armor here, there. So we've got shoulder armor, elbow armor, or back protector. I can't believe they've they've changed this up okay, this much. Uh, let's let's have a conversation about what Engine Hawk is real quick, guys. When Rurock reached out to me, they were telling me that uh, they had this idea for this Engine Hawk brand, and you know they Rurock has a way of kind of coming into a market with a different perspective. This feels entirely different than my other jacket. This feels like I've been wearing, I, I feel like this was given to me from my great, great granddad. It's a grandpappy's jacket. It's grandpappy's jacket. Okay, uh, so when I was talking to the Rurok guys, they were like, hey, we got this idea for this engine hot company and we want to make motorcycle apparel like jackets and whatnot, but we don't want it to necessarily look like a motorcycle jacket. We all know what a motorcycle jacket looks like. It's got like all the patching on it and it's got about, it, you look like a racer cause you got logos all over the place. And they're always jackets that I'm sure they do a good job, but you would never want to wear them anywhere. You would want to, you, you want to wear them, ride to where you're going and then leave your bike on your jacket. Rurok with Engine Hawk wanted to make a apparel company for motorcyclists where when you get off your motorcycle, you just unzip your jacket and you just walk around with your jacket on. The guys in the shop can attest when I first got that prototype jacket, I wore it every day for like two weeks cause I don't know, you know, I'm not, I'm not a real fashionable man. I obviously wear shirts like this. So like fashion is not in the forefront of my, my thought process. So wearing a really nice jacket, like I was feeling pretty fly, not gonna lie. And uh, I am, and I've loved that jacket. That that jacket is the jacket I wear every day. You guys see me on riding first rides with it. And the leather feels really nice and thick, but leather is one of those things that it takes a lot of time wearing something. And apparently Bo telling me like, you gotta condition it and stuff. This is actually, this is much more wearable. I don't know if that makes sense. Like. It feels like it's worn in. Hold on, I gotta I gotta unzip the sides because I'm a thick boy right now. On the other jacket, and yes, I'm a, I'm a thick boy right now. Uh, my weight's gotten away from me, but uh, so there's little zippers here that open it up. So then you can. Ho ho ho! This. Oh, these are different too. These feel way better. These little zipper guys. We got ventilation on the underarm, ventilation here. Now I will say when I first got this jacket, well, the other one, 
I guess you guys in the UK do different stuff, but uh, this tripped me out. I don't, I don't know if you can see me. There's a zipper here at the bottom of this jacket. And I was like, what is that for? And then I was like, wait, I'm a chubby dude now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I had never seen that in a jacket. So we got zippers on the pockets here. Get my whole hand in, feels good. And then on the inside, we have foam pocket. Oh, that's different too. So guys, we've got two jackets. So the jacket in here is the jacket Bo's been wearing. We got two prototype jackets. So I'm only showing you guys this one because I've got the most experience with it. Um, and I'm just kind of curious what they changed because they've only had a month and a half. Okay, yeah, so there, there used to be a little zipper here and now it's literally just this, this uh, grab rail. So that's gonna be a lot easier. You know, if you got gloves on or something like that, you can just like reach in. That's really cool, man. It's been a, it's been a hot minute since I've worn a leather jacket. And I remember the last time I wore a leather jacket, it was, I think it was like some icon leather jacket. I felt like a stuffed up sausage. And you know how when you wear a tracksuit, if you don't, oh, you know, it's, it's like, you do like this a lot. Cause like, oh, I can't breathe and I can't move around. But like, I've got like full, you know, I can do everything in this. Uh, if you guys want to check out Engine Hawk stuff, we will have links in the description. Obviously, I haven't ridden in this one very much, but this is gonna be my primary jacket. It's gonna be the jacket I'm wearing for all my first rides. So, you know, we'll probably ride in them for about two weeks. And after that point, I will let you guys know, we'll do a full review. Here you go, Bo, you can take your box. Uh, Uh, so guys, after about two weeks of riding in this thing, I will do a review and let you guys know what I think about it. If it is anything like my other jacket that I've been riding in, I feel like I'm gonna have a lot of positive things to say about it. But hopefully you guys enjoyed this unboxing video of the world exclusive Engine Hawk reveal jacket things. If you guys wanna check them out, links down below. Thank you guys for watching this video and uh, we'll see you on the next one. Bo is taking the un the typical unboxing experience and uh -oh, just ruining it. Oh snap! Oh, dude, look at the logo. Look at the logo on the back on the hood. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> I'm here for it. Ooh. Ooh. Hold on, stay right there. Let me uh, put your arms over real quick. Look at that engine hog logo. Got the E8. Turn around real quick. Guys, look at the freaking logo on the, on the hood. That's awesome, dude. It's definitely a fall jacket. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> it's got gussets at the top. Oh, very cool. Well, yeah, because then it's got. <laughs> Chubby boy status. Yeah. Chubby boy gang. All right, so if you want to. If you want to get fly like us, you can go to enginehawk.com or whatever their website is. We should probably find that out, but don't worry. The links will be down in the description. This is the logo. Hold on. Can you get a type on this logo? I don't have a... Sh I, I, I'm going to get on them because I want an Engine Hawk shirt like really badly. Okay. That's Engine Hawk. You guys go check it out. Bye. Bye.